<laughs> All right, let's try it again, like um, a third time. Maybe one of these days we'll get through this whole thing live we did last time. and not have any issues. I need to save some money and get a new computer and get a uh, webcam that's faster and better and then maybe we won't have uh, these issues. So I'm going to hang out here for just a little bit until everybody can regroup. I've got one on me. Let's uh, wait for everybody to show up and we'll try it again. I got zero watchers. Dan found me. What's up, Dan? You're in. Dan's there, but I don't see anybody. Amy's back. April's back. Paula's back. <laughs> Joseph's back. Sweet. All right, right. Back. Everybody's good. Sorry, guys. I don't know. It's just uh, my bad crap. I really need to buy better equipment. Now we live in the boonies. So I need better equipment. My internet feed isn't the greatest. Everything's just kind of awkward. So we'll see. He didn't miss much. dust off this table it's funny I can see I know there's people watching and it shows on my deal here that zero people are watching but I see everybody talking people are watching. right on I think it has something to do with this deal all right <laughs> uh, don't keep your mouth open when you're blowing your pumpkin out. Tip of the day. Shut your eyes and close your mouth when you blow out your pumpkin. Especially after you dremel it. Alright, we're going to get to what everybody's here for. We're going to paint this thing. Um, all my pumpkins are painted the same way. If you watch any of my videos, uh, you pretty much see that and know that. Uh, one of these days I'm going to change colors up, but I like the colors... Um, too much so I stick with it. So for painting the pumpkin we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna use white. That's what she said. We're gonna use black. We're gonna use yellow brown and orange. That's it. Those are the base colors to make this pumpkin. Um, it always works out great. I like it. The only thing we're really using the white for is I'm going to real quick paint the inside of this thing white. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on that. I'll go back and refresh it up later. The only reason I'm painting it white on the inside, yeah, it could turn x-rayed real quick. <laughs> the only reason I paint this, you can put that stuff on chat. The only reason I paint this white on the inside is when you put a little light in here, it reflects the light a lot better and you get a better glow. Uh, coming out of the eyes and mouth. So that's why I painted white. And then everything else is going to be uh, almost washes in a way and we're going to start out with a darker base and work our way up and create highlights on this. So uh, stick with me. You know, it may be long, but uh, I'm telling you it's worth it. The end result of this paint is really worth it. If any of you guys have watched the second generation pumpkin tutorials that I've got the uh, the lamp on painting the pumpkin that's exactly how I'm going to do this I didn't get any stringers off this little spider since I last did all this yeah we may be painting stringers too the white is going inside it's just going to be straight white paint. It's not going to be watered down or anything like that. Everything else is going to be a little bit watered down on the outside. But uh, not, not the inside. 
And you're always better off to paint the inside of your pumpkin first. Because you always get a little bit of that paint that you're painting on the inside. It'll come out through the eyes and through the mouth. So you want to get that done first because that way you can come back over with your paint for your pumpkin itself and cover up all that. All that screw up some mistakes you make from painting the inside. Honestly, it'd be a lot easier just to spray paint the inside white. But um, I'm inside the house. And I bitch too much about the smell. And Carrie doesn't like the smell, and it's not good for anybody. So we're going to paint it by hand real quick just to get it done but if you're doing this at home and you're doing it outside grab a little rattle can real quick shoot that up in there you can pretty much get the whole thing painted real quick Jason I'm kicked out in the garbage too <laughs> okay. Well, Carrie tries to kick me out in the garage a lot, but uh, I always wind up in the house. Unless I'm spraying sealer or something. If I'm spraying, if I'm doing something that's going to be pretty nasty, I will go out to the garage. If I have my garage heated and insulated, and all done up, I'd just be out in the garage all the time. I'd have way more room out there than I do in this little craft room down here. Right also makes the other color show up better using a second color inside. Like yeah, like if you put white in here and if you did this like with green or something else inside the other colors for sure. Or if you got white on the inside and you're using colored LEDs, let's say like a green LED or blue LEDs or whatever it is, that white really reflects those colors a lot better. Randall's on. Randall, what's up, brother? And Justin says it's still too cold for him to work in the garage. He needs about another month. Yeah, that's why I wind up inside the house all the time. I usually don't have time to waste. I'm always making something almost all year round. All the time. All the time. Get down, you stupid little cat. She's going to make me mad. Oh, is the cat going to wipe out the computer again? She's trying. We need a little more white. Oh, you know what I didn't bring down here was water to wash my brush it down with. How's that going, Dexter? I just need a, like, it, there's a cup down here. Oh. If he'll come down and get it and fill it up, it'd be awesome. I didn't want to get out there. I was being lazy. See those clear? What about this cup of water? Oh, that'll work right there. Look at that, I was prepared. I didn't even know it. Like a Boy Scout. Be prepared. I was ready to go. I didn't even know it. So how fun is this, watching me stare?